Welcome to Dark Horizon Creations. Guys, today I wanted to take just a minute and do a brief video for all of you who collect the Micro Galaxy Squadron ships and talk about the Target exclusive Rogue One U-Wing. If you haven't watched my product review of that, please go back and watch it where you can see everything I discuss in detail and then come and watch this video. Alright, so in the product review, I discuss numerous quality control issues that have plagued the U-Wings. Warp strike foils, warp engines, warp cannons, and to summarize, you cannot disassemble this ship to repair or replace anything. And it's due to how Jazzware designed the tab system for the top and bottom halves of the fuselage. It includes two vertical Phillips head screws that are inside of the fuselage that you cannot access and they tab down to the bottom half of the ship, locking it in place. So if you pick the ship up and you see all the Phillips head screws on the bottom, here, and you've got two here, two here and one here, you can remove all of those screws, but inside the ship right here and right here on either side of the landing gear, there are sections that have Phillips head screws that you can't access or remove to be able to disassemble the two halves of this ship. So, that's an issue in trying to correct these problems. The other issue is there's no way externally to access these Phillips head screws here and here inside the engine nacelles to be able to repair anything. So during the product review, the canopy was actually closed. I tried to open it. It got wedged open like this. And I tried to force it open. It slightly stressed the plastic here. And I saw that the viewport was already cracked. So on the regular U-Wing, if you look at the canopy, it does have paint on it. And if you open it up, you can see that it opens smooth and there's no paint on the interior of the tab here. So I'm unclear if this is an issue where there is more plastic added here or if it's an issue internally, I just don't know. What I advised everyone to do if they got theirs to open and I got it open without breaking it. And you guys can hear how that sounded. Is to take a file and file down some of the plastic on either side here. Just lightly file these two sides down on either side of this hinge to allow it to open and close and then tab back down. Because as it is, there's stress being applied to this hinge and that's, that's why the cockpit is not securing in place. So I hope that helps you guys if you decide to purchase this particular ship. So those are my thoughts on the QC issues on the Target exclusive Rogue One U-Wing Starfighter.